internet world. So, welcome to my kitchen. I'll be drunk kitchening it up in a bag because I'm poor, but I still want to entertain you guys. So, this drunk kitchen will be featuring Betty Crocker chocolate chip cookie mix and barefoot merlot. Dump all this chocolate goodness in this bowl. I might have pre-gamed for this a little bit. Okay, we will stir in half a cup of butter. I don't think this is even gonna fit. It doesn't fit. Math lesson for the day: a quarter and a quarter make a half. So get a quarter teaspoon, tea cup measuring thing. What do you know? It fits in there. Like it was meant to be. And once you get all the butter out of the first fourth a cup, you get to reward yourself with some wine. Buddy Crocker must be run by Paula Dean. We're gonna crack an egg over in there. Da -da -da -da. So now we mix it all together. No way that all of this is going to get wet. I don't know what to do. I wonder what would happen if I put wine in here. There we go. Now your alcoholic cookies. You can stab your cookie dough if you want. That looks about. Yeah, yeah, that looks good. Looks good to me. Got this shit. I feel like by this point I should be on at least a second glass. I already licked the spoon and it was very sexual, so I'm sorry you missed it. Anyway, now we're gonna drop these bad boys on the pan. Ba ba booey. And another giant cookie. This can be the grandmommy cookie. And it can go. Actually, I'm gonna move you down here next to the granddaddy cookie so that if y'all end up touching it, it'll be like, you're having sex. Wow, all the cookies, all the cookie sheets. And then you save the rest of the cookie dough for a day when you're feeling really shitty about yourself. And you just sit there and eat it and you wallow and, yeah. Eat a little bit of this because I'm a girl and there's cookie dough in front of me, so naturally I'm gonna, you know, do that. And since there's still six minutes left on the timer, we're gonna put some pizza bites in. Huzzah! That's how you open people. Bagel bites. Huzzah and a stab. And then some more wine. Put it in there for 2 minutes and 15 seconds. And if you're a scrubs fan, that's just long enough to take a pregnancy test. <laughs> it says you can make chocolate chip cookies with nuts. Those are like balls. Bet you didn't know cookies turned into pizza bites. They don't. I don't really know. I'm just spouting shit out right now. Now, I'm going to put them on a plate. This nice fancy plate. Why couldn't I have greased this pan? This would have been so much easier. I ate some of that cookie It's fucking delicious, ma'am. I'm going to take the rest of this and make some uh, giant ass cookies with it. So you go there. I don't know those little guys. They don't look like they're gonna grow up to be anything at all, but they're gonna be massive. Hang on. Okay, so I put the large cookies in the oven for 11 minutes. Uh, we have three minutes left. Oh, that's a good cookie. I wish I had milk. But it's okay, because I have one. 
freaking therapeutic is. So I feel like I need something else to talk about, but I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> Let's just drink more wine to fix it. How long does it take cookies to cool? It's like a pancake. Well, I'm gonna overcompensate because I'm so tiny. I don't really care, man. Bitches love me because I'm giant. Oh, look, it's like boobies. Isn't that all you that? They're boob cookies. <laughs> so sexual today. Oh my goodness, sexual Saturday. To YouTube and Tumblr and whoever else sees this video. And to no fat chicks. And yeah. I hope you enjoyed learning how to make Betty Crocker cookies. And I hope I provided some sort of entertainment for your afternoon slash evening whenever I put this up. And yeah. I had fun, so I hope you did too.